Hello everybody, this is Fruit 7G, and today we're playing the Shadow. The Shadow class is a ninja type class that likes to be very fast and agile. And to make up with the speed, he has a, almost the same health as a, as a Wraith of 150. And his arsenals are the, the machine pistols, SMGs, and the katana. And this is in today's gameplay, where I'm using the katana as my primary and as my secondary using an SMG called the Ghost. Normally, if I were to play the Shadow in my typical bases, I'd probably be using my dual pistols, such as the Scorpion and the and the Typhoon. However, in this case, I want to use the Katana because one is probably the most trolling weapon that anyone can use. Because anytime you kill someone with it, it probably drives them mad. Like you say, like something like you Katana noob or something like that. <laughs> you never know. Result results may vary. So. People are, are kind of like have a prejudice against Katana users because it's kind of one is kind of cheap because of his attack power and all. And two, I don't know, I don't know the second reason, but people are just like really hating it and all. So the, the Shinobi is boosting a power of 150, but if you use two skills such as the Shadow Walk and Swift Blade, you can actually amp up the power up to the 195. Which is power, which is very comparable to the Iron Veil or the drone in the Marksman class, and thinking that probably like a really useful weapon if you were to want to kill anyone with like has like anything with lower health and then what max health should be. So, you were wondering how you should actually play this play this type of playstyle. For for me, when I, when I play it, I usually I usually use a good time whenever I'm very close to the person. If anyone, if anyone's far away from me, I'd probably be using a, a my secondary as such as an SMG or a pistol. I've seen people in the past, or not in the, really in the past, but like almost every like, katana user I've seen, they'd probably be chasing after people where the katanas are trying to like get a kill from it, and then most of the time they end up being killed because either one they get too close to them and try to shank them, or two you probably got headshot before they can try. So. For, for what I would suggest for those type of players, like if you're at a certain distance, don't go after and chasing after them. Just use your use your secondary instead and get a good, good kill that way, so like you increase your survi survivability and stuff. In this match, I actually pull off two. I would say two. One of them was a miracle, and the other one was kind of a trolling, a funny thing I just did. One of them was I was able to kill two people. One of them was being tanked, and the other was a grenadier. With a double kill with a katana, and I was able to escape with no damage. <laughs> I don't know how that happened, but you know, anything can happen, I suppose. And the second thing was, I saw there was a invisible ninja, and he's just trying to flank someone apparently. So I was, and I ended up chasing him for a while now, and I don't know for some odd reason, he does not realize me. I was actually behind him, so. So yeah, it was quite funny for him for not take that to me, so after he killed him, I killed him back. <laughs> uh, I wonder what's his reaction after that kill and all. So anyway, I hope you hope you enjoyed the gameplay and hopefully you probably find your inner ninja and uh, try to murder people with katana. Or some of my cases, try to use a good machine people and then overwhelm them with your guns. So hopefully good luck with your matches and hopefully I'll see you in the battlefield later.